Hi, it's Martha, finally, doing another update for Jake's seven months. He is right in his high chair right now eating some uh, graduate's puffs. Jake, hi. Can you say hi to everybody? <laughs> I scared him. So, I'm not sure. I think the last update was at four months. Or five. A long time ago. Too long ago. So, Jake, I'm not, I don't even know what happened last. So, I'm just going to do, like, the recent new, like, milestones and everything that he's gone through. Like, he's seven months today. And, like, a week after he turned six months, he started to be able to sit up on his own. And then, like, a week after that, he started to crawl, which was crazy because it was going so fast. And then, like, another week after that, <laughs> he learned how to wave. Um, like, when you say hi to him, I'll be like, hi, say hi to mama. And then he'll wave to me, like, he just goes like this, like, with his hand, like, all balled up. Because he can't open it yet. And um, he can also um, pull himself up, like, onto stuff and stand up. He does it all the time. And he does it, like, on the like the most unsturdy stuff. Like, he'll just grab onto anything, like, pull himself up at and just think that we're going to catch him. And, of course, we're not, like, there in time to catch him. And he falls a lot, which is horrible. It makes me really sad because he's always hitting his head now. Um, what else? Oh. He had his um, sixth month appointment at the beginning of this month. And he was 27 inches, 27 and a quarter inches long. And 17 pounds, 5 ounces. So he's probably... I don't know. I don't know how much he would be now. It's been like three weeks. I don't even know. No. Today's only the 17th. It's been 17 days since his appointment. So he's probably not 18 pounds yet. I'm sorry. I have my computer on something and it's really wobbly. Kind of to the side. Um, Thanksgiving was good. We had two Thanksgivings actually. A lot of food. He didn't get to eat anything yet, of course, because he's still doing jar food. Oh, I talked about food, too. He still has his eczema really bad on his face. Um, it kind of comes and goes. We still haven't found out, like, what's the cause of it. I've taken out peanuts because we found out he was allergic to peanuts. I don't think I've said that yet. And he still gets it. It's just, like, really dry, like, on his cheeks, like, right here. And scaly and red. I use Eucerin. I've tried, like, the... Um, hydrocortisone steroid that the doctor gives you that's like really strong and then they have this other stuff I'm not sure what it's called that they've given me but the doctor was like be careful how much you use it because it's going to thin his skin and later on in life like when he goes out in the sun and like part of his skin gets tanned I guess that stuff will cause him to have like little white patches on his face and I don't really want that to happen to him so I'm trying to find like a product that's natural and doesn't have like any I don't know what you'd call that, like, medicine, like hydrocortisone or, like, those crazy drugs in it. So if anybody has or knows somebody that had really bad eczema and they don't, like, that's hard to cure and Eucerin and Aquaphor and all those um, typical um, eczema treatments that you find at the store don't work, let me know what does because I'm searching for something right now. And what he's been eating, I also took him off everything that I was giving him. I totally started solids over because I thought maybe his face would um, get better because it was food too. But nothing really changed. It did get a little bit better. So right now he's just getting um, oatmeal. I stopped giving him solids for like four or five days. I didn't give him anything. <laughs> and it was hard because I could tell that he was hungry because he eats like a lot. So now I'm just giving him oatmeal. And I gave him oatmeal for like four days, I think it was, to make sure that that wasn't giving him, like, more of a reaction or more of, um, the red cheeks. I don't know what you would call that. <laughs> more eczema, worse eczema. And that didn't really seem to be the problem. So then I added bananas. So all, all that he's had so far, started over on solids, is oatmeal and bananas. And these things, because he loves to feed himself. And some, um, of those rice, um, Baby mum mums. It's getting cranky right now. Hang on a second. I hope that stays. Do you want to say hi to everybody? He crawls so fast. 
I'll turn my back for like a second and he'll be gone. Can you say hi to everybody? Hello. <laughs> He's waving. <laughs> um, what else? Food. He's, we're still breastfeeding. He um, sleeps in his crib like he'll start the night out in his crib. But usually he'll um, end up in our bed because he's been sleeping very bad lately. Like he would wake up every hour or two until last night he finally slept for eight hours again. Which was a relief because it was horrible. Like I put him to bed. He wouldn't go to bed till like midnight. But he would have like a nap at like five for like an hour or two. And then he would go to bed at midnight and sleep for an hour or two and then wake up. Sleep for another hour and then wake up. It was horrible. And then finally go to sleep for like maybe four hours at the most. So we're trying to make him just sleep in his crib, but it's really hard when he wakes up so much. And I don't know how many times he nurses a day. Probably like every two hours at least still. not He doesn't nurse for as long anymore. It's maybe like five minutes. Sometimes, like if he wants to take a nap, he'll nurse a little bit longer. Um... I don't know, he gets into everything. He's gotten, gotten into the cupboards and pulled stuff out. So we had to lock up our um, cabinet that has, like, all the cleaners and stuff in it. I still let him get into one with, like, the pots and pans because it's exciting for him to open it up and, like, find all the stuff and pull it out. But there's nothing dangerous in there, I made sure. And um, I'm not sure what else to say. I think that's everything. Unless, hopefully, I'll try to... Attach a video of him crawling so you guys can see, and maybe him standing up. Okay? I will hopefully make an update sooner next time. Let me know if you have any questions and uh, comment or message me. Bye! I wanted to show you a video of our Christmas room. If you guys are interested in it, <laughs> this is our Christmas room, our stocking. I guess I'll show a big overview of the room. We, sunk, we hung snowflakes from the ceiling. And there's our tree and all the presents. And Jake. <laughs> our snowman. Who we got from the Goodwill for really cheese. It's so cute. Here's Jake's stocking. I wrote his name on it. And then that one is John's and then mine. And that one's my sister's. <laughs> and this is Jake's first Christmas ornament. <clears throat> And then there's that one. We also have another one that has like a picture frame that we're going to put a picture of um, like Christmas Day in it for next year. It always grabs all the presents. That's why we don't come in here. We had to move the tree actually because it was in our front room where, like, where we always are. But he kept getting all the presents. Hi. Come here, honey. Come here. Come get your toys. He hates his toys. He doesn't play with them. He wants new stuff. <gasps> Hi! What'd you get? He got a needle. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> Here, stand up. Stand up. He's trying to. I'm holding on to the basket. So don't worry, it's not going to fall. Get up! And he also recently started chewing on the edge of his crib. Which scares me. He's going to like ruin his teeth. And he's going to chew on that. He's not going to stand up. We want you to stand up. Stand up! Hi, Jake. What are you doing? Are you sitting? And you're crawling to Mama? Here. He's trying to crawl up on my leg. Look, he's standing. <laughs> what are you doing? He always tries to crawl up me. Look at it. <laughs> okay, let's show everybody how you can crawl. Okay? Sorry if this is making me sick. <laughs> you're going to cry? Come here. Come see Mama. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Oh, and he has two teeth. I forgot to say that. Two teeth on the bottom. And he got that at like five and a half months, and then the other one like two or three weeks later.
Are you coming to see Mama? Are you coming to me?